Okay guys, we're right back where we left off with a, another Assassin's Creed Syndicate video. This is the third video on the channel, or the second video on the channel actually, for Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Um, so in the last episode we were pretty much just going through the tutorial of the game. I don't remember anything from it because I've been playing Ghost of Tsushima the last few days. I know it'll probably be out like probably two months or so when you guys see this video but yeah i've been playing ghost of tsushima recording it but i've been recording this at the same time but this isn't going to be up for a long time Kaylock's looking for me who's but, um, one of staric's gang leaders why does he want you yeah it's after been some of my more arcane this. research into one of the precursor artifacts the piece of eden so tell me about these blighters in search of an army staric gathered up the nastiest of the underworld some of the city's gangs tried to prevent it and were slaughtered for their efforts. Now, only Whitechapel's clinkers remain opposed, but they're no match for the blighters. Well, let's shine these clinkers up then, shall we? They're just the sort we're looking for. You can't be serious. Evie, they're ready to fight and oppose the blighters. This is my chance to step in. Look out, London. Here come the rooks. I'm Sick. Yeah, I, I uh, and uh, so I just looked right now too before starting this. <coughs> Confound this city! No one looks where they're going. Yes, I've noticed that. Bloody drood! I'll never finish it at this rate. Only Providence knows where those words are headed now. Well, I must get to work replacing them. About, Should you ever be in the mood for a tale or two, you can always find me where the ale is warm and tempers are hot. Ta-ta! Of course, we what just an odd Dickens man. Out of nowhere. That Mr. Fry was Charles Dickens. Knows everyone and everything in the city. If I were you, I would keep that connection in your back pocket. <clears throat> Kalok's gang is nearby. They must not follow me back to my shop. We'll take care of it. Yeah. You might be able to use this. Oh, God, I hope so. My carriage is nearby. Make use of it to throw them off my trail. I will meet you at the curio shop. Okay. But what I was trying to say before Cutscene cut me off is, um... Keep moving. We need to leave them away game... from free. Jesus. This game is Here actually trouble. super short. The carriages are easily damaged. <laughs> This thing only has nine sequences. I mean, Unity had 12, and Unity had 15 fast. I would say, because for how long I thought that game was going to be, Unity had 15 fast. Aye, aye, Captain. You're relentless. But, um, that relentlessness will see me yeah, become faster when we finish now. this. George would do nothing of the sort. Right. Yeah. Whatever's left of the creed will perish under your It looks like it's keeping Arch the same words, Unity thing sister. and only having two or three memories per sequence. Because I do we're already on the three sequence, and there's only two Don't tell me you fancy the bloke already. So, I don't think this game's going to take long. And what do you suggest we do if our number one source of information turns up dead? And then we also Staric have copy that part the Jack Thayer for DLC. I say we turn the carriage around like and go find him. This is why you aren't in charge. So, this is actually a very short Assassin's Creed game. The only other Assassin's Creed game with nine sequences is Rogue. And we beat Rogue in like probably 10 minutes, or 10 minutes, or like 10 hours. So, I'm, ex I'm assuming this thing's only gonna have like probably 10 episodes at most. Not including the DLC. Did you give them the slip? You gave them more than that. What the fuck? Just Who are all these people? Over the years, I have established a number of connections across the city. Splendid. We'll need focused aid. Focused aid? <sighs> we take over Starek's gangs. We cripple his control. You're not aiming high enough. Staric has influence in every branch of society. We need to match him. I see what you're saying, Evie. We need the Rooks. You are not starting a gang called the Rooks. I believe I may have an idea of my own. We will need the police to turn a blind eye to our activities. My ally in the force, Sergeant Aveline. I've heard he's a master of disguise. Next up, uh, urchins. 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 Children make for excellent spies. Clara O'Day. Smart as a whip, that one. Finally, you would be wise to remember that Staric never acts alone. 
There are gang leaders in every borough. You'll meet them soon enough, no doubt. Rexford Gaylock. Known for his ability to vanish before your very eyes. Should we make him vanish for real? I suppose. One moment. Um, a Templar target you might want to look into. Uh, be cautious. It's rough out there. No, don't worry about me, Greeny. I can handle a few thugs. Alright, so are we going to get into the open world of London now? Yeah. Sweet. Access the London map, complete conquest entry, capture territory from the libraries, kill the Templars. Okay. Oh, that's why there's only two missions in a sequence, because you have to go around doing four little one missions. Okay. What's the plan then, oh mighty planner? You're the one with the grand ideas. The gangs, the fights. E Can I just, I still can't swap to Evie. Oh my god, I don't want to play as Jacob. He's a goddamn brute and not even close to what an assassin should be. What's Slayer? The guy loses times 10. Your next attack on me puts the target in your death state. Why not? Since we're stuck playing Jacob's buff self. It's gonna curse, but I stopped myself. Wow, look at that. That's so crazy. Belts. Wow. It's like they tried to do what Unity did, but they did it like 10 times worse. It's like a Chinese version of Unity. That's what it looks like. I can make him at least look like an assassin. We'll wear Edward's robes. Now he looks like an assassin somewhat. Oh, I was like, you can change their colors. Why is this skills? Oh, it's because they're stupid skills right here. No. Okay. Even the outfits you're wearing. Perhaps you should leave the way. Dude, he doesn't even wear the hood. If you insist. I thought he was gonna at least wear the hood, but he doesn't. Now I can swap. I hate this game so goddamn much. Hey, Evie. You're better looking than your brother. She has three. So yeah, whenever you switch, you need to upgrade things for that character. So combat is all going into Jacob, and if I know it's going to be a stealth mission, I'm using Evie. Period. Um, yeah, let's go with the loot takedown. I do like that ability quite a bit. Must be level 2. God damn it, Evie, level up like your brother does. Yeah, so she she's not... Okay, there we go. Wow. So she's. I'm not gonna upgrade her combat, combat like at all. I kind. I mean, I think I should at least put maybe a little bit. Just maybe like the health boost, and that's like it. Anything that's health or defense related, not really attacks. Yeah. I think probably just all the way down here would be good. And then this entire tier of stealth would be good for her. And then certain things in the ecosystem. So, like, yeah, all these defense ones would be great for her as well. As scavenger, scavenger would be good for her. Leadership is pretty much a good thing for, uh, what's his face? Jacob. Eagle Vision 2 is good for both of them because it's Eagle Vision. Gunslinger is good for Jacob over Evie. Same with Driver. Okay. Um, outfits. So she has Elise from uh, Unity. She has Avalon. Dr. Daniel's Garments. Shouji. Oh my god, bro, that's slick as hell. She better keep that on too. I'm gonna be pissed if she doesn't. Um, yeah, that's fine. 
Oh, she doesn't keep her hood on either? It doesn't matter. This outfit's still sick no matter what. No, I thought she was supposed to keep her hood. She only keeps her hood on if I keep her base clothes on. Huh. Whatever. Outfits. I kind of like Elise's outfit. I'm not going to lie. That thing looks sick. At least, uh, maybe we'll just keep it on this for a little bit. Um, yeah, I can see me mainly playing as Evie over Jacob. Yeah, Jacob's... Was that his name, Jacob? I don't remember. Fried friends, Jacob. Yeah, I love Jacob. He, he's just a brute, dude. He, he reminds me a lot of Connor. And I didn't really like playing as Connor as an assassin. I like playing as Evie more. She's more stealthy, more assassin-like. How how long do we have to play to until we get the grappling gun? Cause like you can't traverse this world very good without it. I don't see Mr. Abelone. Well, we tried. But they're both wearing classic assassins. I may know a thing or two people. about that splendid fellow you're talking okay. about. What's this? Are you trying to blow the gaff? What? Sergeant Abeline, at your service. I presume you're the Fry Twins Green mentioned. I was expecting you to be a policeman. I was expecting you to be discreet. Henry Green said that you could help us go unnoticed. This is how it will work. I will give you the names of criminal gang members. You will bring them back to me. Quietly. Oh, we'll be as quiet as an old lady. A very hairy, strange old lady that looks a lot like a policeman. Her <laughs> chops just like a classic policeman facial hairstyle. I, I could have just said beard. Now, whatever you do, try to remain within the beard. Okay. For my sake. Don't need any corpses at the station. <laughs> Kidnapping when undetected behind the enemy, press circle to kidnap, move slowly in the enemy's shrink the detection radius. Moving faster, R2 will make it easier for enemies to detect you, show the kidnapped captain into an enclosed carriage. Who am I kidnapping? Him. Identity. Home adult advantage. Completing this challenge will gain extra money and XP. Strategy bring back the target alive. Meet my blade. Get your hands off me! Excuse me. Stop squeezing sorry? people of every last penny and we'll talk. Kaylock, we're okay. of this terrible mistake you've made. You won't have the chance to scream save me, let alone pay Kaylock a visit. Wait, do I just hit circle or do I hold it? I guess I could have knocked him out. Would that have made it easier? Not sure. Probably should have just knocked him out. <laughs> I can't slow down. There's no throttle control for goddamn horses. The only way I can slow down is by not using the boost. Here now. Never need to do anything like this. We don't need cars in an assassin's so This is just a thing. Slow down. I think when I think when um Legion comes out, I kind of want to see him behind compare bars. it towards Thank this, you. since they both take place in London. And aid them. Aiding associates increase their loyalty to the road, so to a more unique and valuable rewards. Okay. My bounty hunt complete, so that district is free. But we have to do a. Is this like a Templar hunt? Yep. 
Top 4 hasn't been in the game since I think AC1 actually. As like a side mission. Did you guys know that side missions in AC1 were added like last minute because his the guy who made it said his son or his son said he didn't like like it because there wasn't enough to do or something like that. I don't remember the exact story. I just think that's crazy that someone's kid just so like this isn't good enough, bro. Make it better. No, He's like, you know what? I will. Money and XP. Kill the target with a crate of dynamite. And carefully. Very good, sir. We want this to come into the blighter's hands without harm. No mishaps. How the f do I get down there? I thought there would be like an open window or something, but it doesn't look like that, which sucks. Oh, there is. Find it very indigestible. Never a quiet moment in London, I suppose. What do you reckon she's up to? She can't be up to much good. How many crates do we have? What is that strange lady doing? Only about the devil. You're not See how many times I just hit that Jesus. That was such a big like radius that I thought it was gonna be. Oh, you have to pick the goddamn lock. Nope, 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 just drop. Hey. Jesus. I am safe up here. They act like they're gonna follow. Mans don't know how to parkours like me, bros. Told you. I didn't expect that dynamite crate to be such a big radius. Like that thing did so much. <laughs> it's crazy. So now we gotta do. So wait, is there only one viewpoint per like area? No, that one has three. Or yeah, this one has three. That one has three. Three, three, three. Or that one has two actually. No, that one has three as well. Oh, that's not bad though. It's not very much. I don't even know if you fast traveling is worth it. To be honest. Oh yeah, I did want to check though what Oh so gold are just lock chests? Okay. I thought maybe they were like initiate chests type things, but Okay. I don't know why I decided to play all these Assassin's Creeds like four years later for the first time. Because Unity was, that was my first time playing Unity all the way through at least. I mean, I played it back in like probably 2018. Only for a few hours that I got through like maybe two sequences and then I stopped playing. I don't remember why, I don't know if there was just a bunch of games coming out and I started playing those and then I got distracted. And Make me come over there. I either deleted it and never Why reinstalled it or I just, I just never wanted to play again. I don't know. It turned out to be a really good Assassin's Creed though, I enjoyed it a lot. This one I'm playing, what, three years later or so? Origins is going to be so good when we get to it though. That was like one of my favorite Assassin's Creeds I played through and beat. And I almost 100%ed the base game of... I actually almost have the trophy, the Platinum Trophy for the Assassin's Creed, uh... Um, Origins. 
which at the time, that was the closest I got to a platinum, but now I have the platinum for days gone. AC2, um... What is this? So, AC2 I have the platinum for, I have the platinum for Coney Exiles, I have the platinum for uh, Days Gone, I have... I, know, I think that's it right now. I want to do more, but... I, I did... I was gonna make the platinum videos. Damn it, he comboed me and murdered me, Jesus Christ. I was gonna make those, those Road to Platinum videos, but I ended up getting caught up in filming videos and doing other things because I've been working more than I used to at least. I've been working more, trying to get money built up because I am i can't work a full job. I can't work a normal job right now because of what's going on in the world. So, because my mom won't let me work a normal job because she wants me to stay safe and things like that and she doesn't. We can't have people getting sick in our family because some people have pre-existing diseases and uh, problems with their health and stuff like that in my family. So I can't really be getting sick because my family comes over a good amount. But so I right for the moment at least I can't really get a normal job. And to be honest, I don't really want like a cashier job or anything. Right now I'm working outside doing irrigation. And I I love that way more than I can I would love being a cashier or something stupid like that. You know what I mean? Like I can't do that. I either have to be outside or I have to be doing something like this. I can't I can't be talking to people all day, bro. You know what I mean? It's not my type of job. I mean maybe I can stock like shelves and stuff like that. But I think you even have to like work up to that. Like you can't start stocking shelves. Which isn't that weird though? Like you can't just start it doing shelves like right away you have to do a bunch of other sh stupid crap but like yeah so I've been trying my best I, I have to work like super super slow I'm getting paid maybe 80 bucks a week because I how, how little I'm working But with how little I'm working, I only can make enough to get, to not even get the, uh, the PlayStation, like, right now, if I actually do get the, the Switch, which it's looking like I Perhaps probably we can harness will, the gangs after all. but, um, if I do get enough for the Switch, well, if I can get the Switch, um, there's a high chance that I won't be able to buy the PS5 at launch, which I mean is fine. I can I can wait like a few months to get it. You know what I mean? As long as I have Valhalla and uh, Cyberpunk, I'm fine. You know what I mean? Because that's pretty much the only content you guys are gonna be able to see for the rest of this year anyway. You know what I mean? Because the way content is working right now, or the way video games just are this year, there's not too many coming out. If I'm being honest, there's not as many games coming out as games I thought there would be, which is good. It's mainly just a Ubisoft game, you know what I mean? Like, pretty much all the games I'm Perhaps buying. Perhaps we can harness the gangs after all. But. Yeah, I've been. I've been working and stuff and been getting caught up doing other things so those plat those road to platinum trophies are gonna take a little longer to get than or to film than I originally planned on because I wanted brotherhood to be done but then I had to stay up on these videos like so th this will be different by the time you guys see this but there hasn't been an Assassin's Creed video on the channel in like two weeks and it's mainly because I just got done filming uh, Unity not that long ago. And then as soon as I got done filming Unity, I started uploading Kingdom Hearts. And then by the time I was done uploading Kingdom Hearts, Ghost of Tsushima was out. So right now I can't upload anything because of everything going on right now. So, I mean, I'm going to try and start getting Unity up, but it's like... 
right now I'm preoccupied with uh, Ghost of Tsushima. So pretty much I'm just filming this on the side while I film Ghost of Tsushima just whenever I want to switch it up a little because I don't want to play Ghost of Tsushima nonstop because then that's how you get tired of it quick, like you know what I mean? I'm trying to pace myself on that game and not get everything done right away, you know what I mean? Mate, pretty much what I want to do is just the wrong kind of play the story. I, I want to play the story of Ghost of Tsushima yes, because you be, Mr. It's, it is a really As good story like. so far. I want to play through it though and then I just want to go from there, you know what I mean? Did he just dip? Preoccupied with other stuff, so those red to platinum videos probably will be on here for a while. I, I want to do it too for more than just um for more than just uh, the Assassin Creed games. I want to do Road to Platinum for quite a few games. The Assassin's Creed games are just what I had in mind because usually by the time we beat them, we're maybe like at least like 60% of the way done with trophies you know what I mean so that's why I would want to do those but I mean I kind of want to do it with other games too we there, we haven't really played too many FPS's on the channel I really do want to play good FPS I was I did start filming Wolfenstein but then I kind of stopped feeling it and didn't really want to play it as much so I just stopped playing it I deleted all the footage but um it, actually Wolfenstein was really good I, I beat it on my own time but uh, I stopped filming it because I just didn't have time to film that. Like, I had time to play games, but I didn't have time to film, if that makes any sense. Filming, I have to do at a certain time because how many people live in my what house right now? What is this place? Like that. It's nice to meet you both at last. This is Babylon Alley. Here, we make it our business to know the streets and provide children with the opportunity to control their own destinies. Clara, Mr. Green said we might be able to help one another. In exchange for our services, we ask a small favor. Well, why not? You seem to have taken most of my money. Why not take a small favor, too? There are several factories about the city that are powered almost entirely by child labor. Those children work long hours with little pay, and most are not permitted even to leave the factory grounds. They suffer terribly. I need you to save them. A small favor. In return, we offer you intelligence. Something you clearly need. Oh, hold on a minute. I'm late for an appointment. What are these terms? We accept. <laughs> Pleasure doing business with you. Okay. Uh, yeah, so I mean, I had plans and like the random videos I did film one of those I think actually I still have the video on YouTube I just never made a thumbnail but I have one of the random videos done it's probably trash though I filmed it on my phone it was just some mobile games that I found but um so I did I know I did say I want to do the random videos and the road to platinum but for now, those are all set on hold, which really sucks because I really, I, I put so much time into that first, in the first, like, I made, like, two random videos, and I ne random game videos that I never uploaded. I might do a random game video with, Go uh, not Ghost of Tsushima, Ghost Recon Breakpoint, just because it got that big update not too long ago. And I really, really have been enjoying the update, actually, and I, I would like to show you guys it on the channel. Because I know not too many people follow Ghost or Ghost Recon anymore because of the launch of Breakpoint. But I'm being honest, like it's so much better than it was at launch. And I I just I think people should give the game another chance. But also, um, it would just be fun to go and do big games like that that I already have time in, and just do it on the channel as a random game video. You know what I mean? I, I would love to do that. Maybe go back and because I know my original um, hang in there. What was it you, my original um, Generation Zero gameplay too? That was trash. Like the quality was really bad sound-wise. But um, I I would like to 
bring that back to the channel, maybe for a few episodes. But, um, yeah, let me know, because I'm still gonna, I'm gonna try to get some random videos, random game videos out at least twice a week, hopefully. Um, but if you guys have recommendations for that, do let me know. Um, if they're reason, if games are reasonably priced too, I'll, I'm willing to buy a new game or something to do that. But let me know. And then Road to Platinum. If you guys have certain games you want to, you want me to just get the platinum for, let me know. I, I mean, I don't really go for platinums too much. I usually go when I have quite a bit done. Cause like, so. The way it, the reason I got it for Days Gone is because by the time I was done with Days Gone, I needed to finish pretty much all the open world stuff, and then that, that was it. And well, the open world stuff and get all the weapons, which is part of the open world stuff. So I did that, and by the, the only thing that I had to go out of my way to do and that suck a bunch was um doing the uh. That was like a drift for like 500, or not 500, like 300 meters, I think. And that was a pain because you had to upgrade the bike fully. And then after you did that, you had to, um, you had to use your NOS correctly to drift uh, for as long as possible. And you had to get to this like open pasture area, which you don't really find much of those on the map because they're usually dense forest or little towns. But, um,. It, it was it was pretty tough to do. I I would like to go back though and do Days Gone on the channel because I know I started a new game plus. I mean I could pretty much just start where I left off for the most part. I mean I remember the story really well. It's not really too hard to remember that story. It was a really good story. But um, yeah. So I mean, just let me know what you guys want to see for the random games and for uh. And for the uh, road to platinum, because I mean, Ghost of Tsushima. To be honest, depending on how close we are, that could be our like how close we are when we're done with the game. That could be our first. Um, that could be our very first. Uh, what is it? What is it called? I'm, I'm struggling right now. That could be our first uh, road to platinum uh, episode. Which, I mean, I think the Road to Platinum uh, things would be probably maybe two to three episodes at minimum. Because I wouldn't want to just do one of me getting a Platinum. I would want to do like maybe one or two Road to Platinum videos per game. But, I mean, I'm willing to do Ghost of Tsushima because that's such a good game. And, I mean... I don't believe that those would be too hard to do, just based off playing the game. I don't think they're going to be all retarded like some games are, like, okay, hear me out, but like, you, like, what is Ubisoft doing with the Assassin's Creed trophies? Get 100% sync on every mission in the game, like, are you retarded? Like, I know it's possible, I know a lot of people do it, but it's just... It's so tedious and annoying, like, why would you want to do that? You know what I mean? Like, I don't want to do that. Like, that's the main reason I stopped trying to film the Brotherhood thing at the moment. Was because it was getting tedious because you had to do that. You have to restart that 25-minute mission. You know what I mean? It's like, it, it just sucks. Ah, Ghost of Tsushima, I are. think, could be our first one. All that stands between you and Whitechapel I want to do Breakpoint as a random game video. Kalok has demanded you settle the claim for territory in the gang. Zero. His loss. I have a few more too yeah. that I would like to do. I'm sure you can put this to I'm better use than I can. Get, oh, maybe get some greeny? little little games, littler indie games to like uh, the light of YouTube because <laughs> not really too many people have heard about them. Gather your I like allies. to let people know about those games. You know what I mean? But um, I don't know. It'd be there's a lot I still want to do. I know I said this when we were filming Black Flag, but I mean, there's a lot I want to do. I'm excited to do more stuff on the channel. It's just, it's hard with the schedule I have and with the setup I have. I think it would be easier if, one, my PS4 worked so I could actually directly upload videos from the PS4, but that doesn't work. And. 
and it would be easier if I could upload more than two videos at a time because right now I'm focusing all my uploads on just Ghost of Tsushima pretty much I'll try out the Kirky why not um, how do I upgrade it upgrade preview upgrade this item I'm assuming you can only upgrade these once just like yeah just like you need okay Mr. Rexford Kalock has agreed to your terms and waits for you at the Whitechapel train station. He's bet his train on the fight. This is something I should have done as Jacob, but I wasn't thinking before I started it. So, sorry about that, guys. Where are you, Kalock? Perhaps this will draw you out. Yeah, Rex! so there's a lot I want to do on the channel and things like that. And oh, I'm sorry that a lot of things are being put on hold. I'm just I'm thinking that would be easiest if I did it. I think once I stop working and school starts again, it'll be a little easier too. Just because school's all online this year for me at least. I mean, we have the option to go back to school, but my mom again said so we should stay home this year and see how it goes next year. You know what I mean? But um. God damn it, I'm hitting the wrong button the way. I start, I hit the sprint button. I've been playing way too much Ghost of Tsushima. God damn it. Yeah, I've been playing way, way too much Ghost of Tsushima. All my controls feel so weird. But, um... I haven't really been... been staying up on the channel as much as I would like. I mean, I went like two weeks without even touching the channel and just like strictly uploading some videos. Or recording videos. Like, I recorded Kingdom Hearts and Unity for like a month. And I didn't touch the channel that entire time. You know what I mean? So it's like, I, need to, I don't want to be right anymore. I want to be constantly on the channel uploading stuff. And I, I want to stop filming videos like months weeks in advance of when they actually go up. When they actually go up. What the hell is going on? You know what I mean? I wanna... I guess I wanna be more involved with the channel than I am. Per se, and I know a lot of my commentaries get boring at points and I wasn't talking about what going on with this game right now, bro. I, that's not my fault! That's not my fault! The frames are dropping and shit. Look at that, it's freezing Why I'm getting murdered. But I, I, I want to be more involved with the channel than I have been. I want my. I, I know I need to work on my commentary because there's a lot of points where I don't say stuff or I just don't talk. Like I, I don't. I just talk about a bunch of random crap. This isn't random crap per se. This is meant for the video. You know what I mean? This is for the channel. This is. I I, I do soon want to make a proper video of me sitting down and just telling you guys giving you guys the info that I have for the channel everything that's in my brain that I thought about to make the channel better in any way shape or form if you guys have recommendations too please let me know in the comments below um, I'll do my best to read them and think about them hard and uh try to put what you guys recommend into my videos if you guys need more energy i'll put more energy things like that if you guys want better editing style because i know my let's plays video my let's play videos don't have any any uh editing at all i just hope you guys do it. i just personally feel like let's plays shouldn't have editing because they're let's plays it's supposed to be my raw gameplay experience and just overall how I felt about it, how I feel about the game, um, things like that. So, like, you guys should see the games in their purity and not just edited little cuts on it, you know what I mean? I know a lot of YouTubers do that, but, like, they don't actually play the full series on the channel, they just give you, like, little cuts of the game, which, I mean, yes, that's appealing for a lot of YouTubers, but for me, I would rather have less plays and, like, maybe a little multiplayer videos with my friends and things like that, which sucks, you, because my friends don't really like to film videos. And when they 
to play, it's more of just informal and us doing just a bunch of random crap. And, I mean, we played Minecraft for like eight hours, and there was like not really any funny moments. It was just straight up us building a house for literally eight hours. So, we would like to do more, but. How can you block a bullet with your wrist, bro? Oh, I hit circle. God damn it, I suck. I need to hurry up too because the video is like, I have 12 minutes until the video needs to end or it hits over an hour. And I can't do that right now because I'm filming on the PS4. But yeah, so I mean, if you guys have recommendations, let me know. I've been, I've been trying to make the channel a little better, a little different. I've been, I've been working on the way I produce thumbnails too. Editing isn't really a big thing in my videos at the moment because there's not too many mobile or not mobile but online and and co-op videos and things like that. There's not as many of those as I would like on the channel, but I. I'm more of a single player kind of guy. I like playing single player games more than I like playing multiplayer games to a degree. I used to I used to only play multiplayer games on the PS4. It used to be just Rainbow, GTA Online, and COD. That's it. That's all I would play. And a little bit of Overwatch and Apex. That's it. But lately, it's for the last probably year, year or so. I've only been playing like single player games. Single player games, I just, I personally love single player games way more. I, I like, I like going and playing and learning about a whole different world that you, you can't get stuff like single player games in multiplayer games ever. You know what I mean? So I just, that's why I prefer single player games. Single player games to me have more experience. If you have friends that actually like to play the same games as you, then that's where you go. Fuck, I'm gonna die. God fucking damn it, I suck. But, I mean, if you have friends that like to play the same online games as you, then it's good, but... My friends pretty much only play Minecraft, COD, and GTA. And I kinda grew- I mean, I, I still love playing GTA, but they don't play as much as they used to. But, um... I'm not really into COD anymore, or at least Modern Warfare, it kind of, for me, that's how it is always for CODs though, for me, like I played the hell out of it until like February, and then I just stopped, that's usually how it is for me with CODs though, I'll play them for a few months and then I just get worn out, I mean I have Fallout 76, none of them like Fallout 76, I mean that's okay, but like come on bro, play Fallout with me sometimes, you know what I mean? But they're, they're pretty much only playing Minecraft, and it's like, yeah, Minecraft's fun. I love Minecraft. It's a good game. I don't play it that much, but when I do, I, I have fun. But they like to play it, like, all the time. It's either that or GTA Online, but it's usually Minecraft. I'm just like, I can't play Minecraft that much, dude. Like, I love the game, don't get me wrong, but it's like, it's so boring sometimes. And it's just, yeah. But, like, if I had friends that like to play the games I played, I would, like, I mean, I could have easily done, like, some other play videos for Unity, but none of my friends want to play Unity. And, I mean, it's it's not like they don't have the game. I game share with three of my friends right now. The two of my friends are right and So, I mean, it's not like they can't play the game. They just choose not to. I hit circle. What the hell are you talking about? What the fuck are you talking about, bro? I'm hitting circle. Are you retarded? But, god damn it. But, yeah, there's a, Online games would be fun to do on the channel, but my friends don't really play the online games I want to film. Like, I would love to film Fallout 76 with friends, but it's not really a thing. <laughs> no one likes to play Fallout 76 with me. I have one friend that plays it, but I don't talk to him anymore, really. Um, and then even like, uh, what is it, Rainbow. My friends don't really play Rainbow that much. Uh, to be fair, I don't play Rainbow that much anymore, but that's because none of my friends really play Rainbow anymore either. 
So it's it's like tonight all they were playing was Minecraft and they were like, You wanna play? I'm like, No, not really tonight. I'm just gonna hit the hay, bro, and go to bed. So I slept for a few hours and now I'm up filming at three in the morning. But um I I would like to f I would like to play more games with my friends and film it and put it on the channel. Man, it's just it, it's it's iffy because none of them really want to play the same games as me and things like that. And yeah, but um, also it's just like editing online games. I it's harder for me to do just because I have no editing software. I have Share Factory. If you guys don't know what Share Factory is, it's a uh, it's an editing software on the PlayStation 4. It comes with the PlayStation 4. It's pretty much your standard PlayStation. It's it's standard with little YouTubers like myself that play on PlayStation. I mean, Xbox has a few video editors, which are really good because they're literally just Windows 10 editors uh, released on the uh, on the PlayStation or on the Xbox One. See, like, this is like, the fact that he has this much health, though, is retarded, you know what I mean? Oh, and the smoke grenades, the smoke bombs don't work on this train. Okay, he's dead. I mean, if you, if you guys want to play games with me, let me know if you guys have PlayStation. It appears to be broken. Oh, well. At least we have a train now. It's not all bad. But yeah, if you guys want to play games with me, uh, let me know. Leave, leave your uh, PSN names down in the description, down in the comments, and I'll add you guys. And well, I'll look at what games you guys have on your accounts if it's public. Some people have it private, but if it's public, I'll look at the games you have on your account and. See see if there's some games I would like to film with you um, that would that would actually help a lot and let me play with my audience you know get to know my audience get to learn about my subscribers things like that so if you guys do want to play with me leave that in the comments below if don't leave nothing in the comments below it's whatever but, yeah. Whitechapel is no longer in the hands of the Blighters. You now have the chance to join our ranks. We welcome all who would stand up to Steric and his cutthroats. Also, I'm being honest, I haven't really been paying attention to the story of this game. At all. <laughs> Welcome to the Rooks. <laughs> yeah, I haven't been paying too much attention to the story of this game. This game just seems like I'm just gonna go through it, hacking and slashing bastard. for the most part. I'd rather part, throw myself to the tracks and run Bertha another mile for that dirty bull bag. Kaylock? <laughs> He's left the station. Mel, hello, fancy pants. You I'm Evie Fry, and this is my brother, Jacob Fry. Pleased to meet you. I'm Agnes McBean. A delight. I thought I was getting a promotion. I suppose I'm out of work now. Come work for us instead. <laughs> I always bail your heat. You pay better than scraps? Oh, I'm sure we can at least match that. <laughs> then may I present to you Agnes and Bertha, lady and locomotive, at your service. I'll be in the next car. A hideout on the rails? What an excellent idea. Yes, it all worked out rather well. Now, I would like to follow up a lead on... Jacob? Is this serious? I'm not doing anything until this gets fixed. I believe I know someone who can help with that. I knew you would, Greeny. Why is that so fucking aggressive? Jesus, what a douche, Jacob. God. He's so goddamn aggressive all the goddamn time. God damn it. Alright. 
Well, we're just gonna end the episode there, guys. Um, if you guys enjoyed, please don't forget to like. We still haven't even got to the second memory. What the fuck are you talking about, you goddamn crackhead? Jesus. Um, but yeah, that's where we're gonna have episode, guys. If you guys enjoyed, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Please comment down below what you guys want to see on the channel in the future. I'll see you guys very, very soon with another Assassin's Creed Syndicate video. Peace out.